In the field of differential equations, Maple has a lot of versatility. For this session, we'll go over some of the basics. Firstly, I'll load the Student Calculus 1 package as we will be accessing the differential tutor through its command. To start with, we can use Maple palettes to build limit expressions or differential equations. For this example, let's find the limit of x squared over x plus 5 when x approaches 2. We can also use the limit command as opposed to using the calculus palette. Similarly, we can use the diff command to determine the differential equation of this expression. If you are provided with just an expression such as x squared over x plus 5 and you are to determine what the differential equation will be, you can, use the, you can use Maple's context panel and apply the differentiate command with respect to x. To solve a limit or differential equation interactively, you can use Maple's tutors to do so. So for this example, I'll use the differential equation tutor. The tutor provides a set of rules which you can click on and apply to get your final answer, or you can get hints, or see the next step, and finally if you want, you can see all the steps involved in solving the equation. Maple also provides the ability to explore mathematical concepts visually and interactively through in math apps. As an example, we can take a look at the mean value theorem math app. As you can see, the math app provides a brief description behind the mathematical concept and then lets you interactively choose a certain expression or lets you enter in your own and the plot updates once you press the button. Task templates provide a convenient, fill-in-the-blank problem solving for over 300 tasks. Many templates use point-and-click components, turning them into mini calculators. Others provide the command or sequence of commands that you need to accomplish your task. Simply fill in the blanks with your own values to find the solution. I selected the following task template as an example. Here we can simply enter in a unit variate function to find the minimum and maximum of a f the function. <laughs> 